How to fix wait on database engine recovery handle failed? Check the SQL Server error. Hello everyone, and let's get started. If you are not able to install the SQL Server, here is a quick way by which you can fix it. So, to get started with, you have to open your registry editor. For that, you can either search for the registry editor on the search bar or open the run tab and type in regedit. Once the registry editor is open, you need to go to this location which is Computer, HK Local Machine, System, Current Control Set, Services, STORN, VME, Parameters and Device. Once you reach on this location, you have to now click on the blank space which is on the device folder. Right click, click on New and select multi-string value. Once you click on multi-string value, you have to create it, naming it as force physical sector size in bytes. It has been mentioned on the description box. After that, click on it. After that, click on the multi value and then go to its value data type. Set in the value as asterisk 4095 and click on the OK button. Once this is done, you can close the registry editor. Now next up, there is a command that has been given on the description box. So you have to open command prompt and run it as administrator and paste the command. It is for enabling the port. Once this is done, you can restart your computer and then try to reinstall the SQL server and it should work fine. So that is up for today's video. For more such contents, do not forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Thank you and keep watching.